chapter 14 of The Giver, the giver introduces Jonas to the idea of pain by transferring another memory of sledding down a hill, a memory that ends with an accident and a broken leg. Jonas experiences pain so intense, he vomits into the snow. When he awakens, he asks for a relief of pain pill, but the giver refuses. Later that evening, Jonas realizes that his parents and sister have never known pain. He feels desperately lonely. Each day of Jonas's training now contains pain, such as a horrible memory of being neglected and starving. The giver explains that these terrible memories are important in order to achieve wisdom that will prevent people from repeating the mistakes of the past. Jonas suggests that it would be easier if memories of pain and destruction could be shared. More people would have wisdom, lessening the burden on Jonas and the giver. But the giver explains that people don't want the memories of the pain. They just want to be told what to do. Jonas angrily argues that the two of them should try to change things. At home, Gabriel is growing as he should, but is still unacceptably restless at night. Father worries that he may still be released, and Mother says it may be for the best. Father also mentions a birth mother is about to have twin boys, and one of them will need to be released, a decision Father will make. They will release the smaller of the two. Jonas offers to keep Gabriel with him at night so his parents can get a good night's sleep. That night, when Gabriel becomes restless, Jonas pats him on the back to comfort him and recalls a lovely sailboat memory. Without meaning to, he begins to transfer the memory to Gabriel, who becomes calm, and the image grows dimmer in Jonas's own mind. When Gabriel wakes again toward morning, Jonas purposefully gives him the rest of the memory, and the child once again is calmed. Jonas decides not to tell anyone about this. Jonas, now aware that he and the giver are the only two responsible for all the memories and suffering of the world, becomes increasingly angry at the unfairness of it all. Jonas feels increasingly isolated the more he understands. Plus, the image of Jonas's parents as wise and loving adults has been shattered.